we fried uh, the okoy during the break, and these are the foods that will be served on Sunday. We have, what's this, uh, Marianne? Chicken. That's uh, adobo wings. Uh-huh. Wow. That's um, a breakfast roll with pasino and egg uh -huh. and garlic rice. Wow. And that's the okoy. That we fried earlier. Yeah. Yes, yes. And, of course, there are foods, there are different dishes that we can try, but we can't have food without drinks, correct? Of course. Yes. <laughs> Those hand in hand. Mm -hmm. So we actually have four uh, custom-made Filipino-inspired cocktails made by Michael. Mm -hmm. He is a mixologist over at NOLA's, and he's going to show you if you're just joining us, we're talking about the Filipino food and cocktail sparing event that's going to happen on Sunday at NOLA's. Yes, that's and these are only three of the dishes that are on the menu because there are more. Actually, Marianne, let's talk about the lechon. There is two types of lechon. We have two huge ones, Manila style and Cebuano style. Mm -hmm. We have four types of dessert, including uh, a special uh, turon ice cream from Magnolia ice cream. Um, and just a lot of food, a lot of drinks. So this and, isn't it. This is just it. Yes, tickets cost 50 bucks each, but then you get to get it. You get to go in. You get to try the drinks. You get to try the foods, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Everything. Everything. Ah. Photo booth, raffle, gift bag. Exciting, and yes. that's on Sunday. And we'll give you the information also later on the show. But Mike, tell us, how did you get involved in this? Um. Well, in alcohol or in it, with this event. With this event, oh, I managed the bar at Nola's mm -hmm. and uh, create the cocktail menu over there. Right. So it's, Chef Edric asked me to create Filipino inspired cocktails and just was, kind of you know just kind of dipped into the ingredients. Was it difficult for you because since you're not Filipino you're not familiar with the ingredients because mm. I see ube there. Not at all not at all I, I actually grew up with a lot of Filipino people so I'm familiar with the, with okay. the flavors and the taste and the ingredients so all right. it kind of made sense. Ube passion? Yeah. What does that have? Uh, it's got fresh mint, ube, rum, uh, calamansi nectar which is the key ingredient. Mm -hmm and passion fruit juice. All right, let's try to mix now. Let's do it. All right. Let's start with a mixing glass, uh -huh. some fresh mint. I'm excited. I know. I kind of <laughs> want to drink it now, too. Really? <laughs> I'm interested to find out how the ube mixes with the drink. I mean, I've never, I know ube is good for a dessert, right? Mm -hmm. But then in a drink, I don't. It mixed very well because we actually tried all, all mm -hmm, four. Mm -hmm. Another one was like Manila Mule. We had one that was uh, a lychee martini with calamansi nectar. Mm -hmm. uh, what was the other one that we had? There was um, That was calamansi, right? Yeah. Calamansi. Oh, okay. Yes. And this is calamansi concentrate? Calamansi nectar. Nectar, okay. Which is thicker. Yes. Thicker. Is it tardier or sweeter? It's a bit More sweeter. Sour, sweeter. It's a bit sweeter. Okay. So okay. we're doing about, uh, about 8 to 10 mint leaves. Okay. About a uh, half ounce of calamansi nectar. Okay. We're going to do two ounces of uh, rum. Okay. Light rum. Rum, okay. And we're going to do about a teaspoon of ube. I love ube. Wow. I love ube too, but as a dessert, not as a drink. Yeah. So it's cool because it's very custom made for our event. Right. And I mean, this is the first, the only place that you'll be able to try it. Right. And you're talking about the foods, also the dishes. They're not like your plain Filipino food, right? Because yeah. we got their uh, adobo wings, mm -hmm. and and this one is what a breakfast. No breakfast. Or yeah. <laughs> so it's Filipino inspired with yeah. all the flavors right. that we're used to, but so just with a little twist stuff. to it. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh, it's interesting. Here we're adding a uh, passion fruit juice. Yeah. Who can go? So anyone can go as long anyone, as they buy the ticket. Up, oh, of, of the drinks, and up because of, of the drinks. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. But we are selling tickets online at mm -hmm. sixtaste.com mm -hmm. as well as at the door. Um, do you offer discounts for people who, or it doesn't matter? Um, not right now. Not no. right now. Okay. No discount. Tickets, but but tickets are still available, right? Yeah, tickets yeah. are still available. And now we're shaking. You don't need to crush the ice. No. Okay. Shake it very well. Uh huh. And then. And then we're gonna strain it. What is this? What is this that you uh, added? Uh, passion fruit juice. Oh, passion fruit juice. Yes. Okay. And there's that. And we're gonna go, go and garnish with a coconut gel. Which is not the de coco, which is my favorite too. Yes, slippery. Para sang halo halo. Yeah, para halo halo. Halo halo. Yeah. But alcoholic version. I know. But I just can't <laughs> wait to try. Isn't that pretty? This is it. Yeah. Okay, I want to try. Yeah. <laughs> well, you said this is your favorite. Yes. Let me try. What's so special about this drink? Anything? I think that it's very different. Mm -hmm. I haven't had an ube pas an ube type of alcoholic drink. Do you it's taste the ube? No. No, I don't. Do, are you supposed to taste the ube? It's a good mix. A of little bit. It's more about the texture. Mm -hmm. It's a little. Uh, yeah. It's a little. Yeah. I. I. I the texture. I. How do you 
how do you describe that texture? It's just uh, grainy. A little grainy. Yeah. yeah, a little grainy. Yeah. And um, it kind of tastes a little bit like uh, guava. Mm. Is that is that supposed? Uh -huh. Yeah. And then uh, mm, it's really good. And what are the other drinks that you have? Uh, we have a lychee cu cucumber cocktail. Uh, we also have a manila mule, which contains bourbon and ginger beer and calamansi, and also a spicy calamansi margarita. And these are all special mix, um, special, uh, special cocktails, specially mm -hmm. made for the event. Yes. So after this night, they might not be able to try it anymore, right? If they ask uh, Mike and sure. they right. go to Nola's, sure. right. yeah, uh -huh. he'll be able to make it. But How long that. did it take you to make these um, cocktails? About an hour. About an hour? So you're good. Like, how do you know which one tastes it's, good with what? Well, it's like cooking. You know, uh -huh. you just you get the ingredients and you just start uh, playing with different flavors. Right. And you kind of, after a while, you understand what works well. Mm -hmm. so. Sounds good. Yeah. And I'm so excited to go Sunday at NOLA's. We'll see you there. Go ahead. Final invitation, Marion, to all the viewers. So come one, come all. You don't have to be Filipino. Just We just want to share Filipino food with everyone. And it's 6 p.m. at NOLA's in downtown L.A. You can get all the information on 6taste.com and buy the tickets there. It'll be a lot of fun. Lots of food and two lechons and yes, all these drinks. two lechons. That's yeah. what I'm very excited about. The it's lechons. a carving station, too. Wow, I'm a lechon so excited. Carving station. Can you save the buntot for me? <laughs> or we'll the thing? It. We'll save it just for <laughs> all you. All right. Thank you so much and more power. I'll see you on Sunday. Yes. See you on Sunday. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll be back more in Cabo Bay and LA. Don't go away.